Hello, Emmanuel family. It's Pastor Rick, and it's great to be with you for just a couple moments today. Thank you for taking this time to check out this video devotional thought today. Well, we've had a great kickoff to our fall campaign, Emmanuel Go Be the Church. Sunday was an amazing day on campus. If you were there, you know exactly what I'm talking about. What a great and powerful time of worship. Well, we kicked off our series by considering the truth that we must go be the church at home first. And so I thought I would share this video devotional thought from our house, from our yard today, just to encourage you and to bring the word of God and the word of truth to you. You know, the word of God says in Deuteronomy chapter six, these are the commands, the decrees, and the regulations that the Lord your God commanded me to teach you. Now, this is Moses speaking. He said, you must obey them in the land you are about to enter and occupy. And you and your children and grandchildren must fear the Lord your God as long as you live. If you obey all his decrees and commands, you will enjoy a long life. Listen closely, Israel. Listen closely, Emmanuel, and be careful to obey. Then all will go well with you, and you will have many children in the land flowing with milk and honey, just as the Lord, the God of your ancestors, promised you. Listen, O Israel, the Lord is our God, the Lord alone. And you must love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your strength. And you must commit yourselves wholeheartedly to the commands I am giving you today. Repeat them again and again to your children. Talk about them when you were at home and when you were on the road and when you're going to bed and when you're getting up. Tie them on your hands and wear them on your forehead as reminders. Write them on the doorpost of your house and on your gates. In other words, always keep the word of God before you at home. I know home is one of the most difficult places for us to be the church. Uh, they know the good, the bad, and the ugly about us. But I want to encourage you today. I want to encourage you to be at your spiritual best at home. Love like Jesus. Walk in the light. Walk in wisdom. And share the truth of God's word with your family. So let your light shine before men so that they may see your good works, see your good deeds, and bring glory and honor to your Father in heaven. The best place to do that, perhaps, is right there at home with your family. God bless.